working in there, helping him build his career, and he left her at the house for the not getting ready for an engagement party yeah. or some type of party. He left yeah. her and was like, yeah, I'm going with her. You going with who? Okay. So I guess what we're saying is men really are that bad. They're that bad. <laughs> They're that bad. <laughs> They're that bad. They're that bad. <laughs> oh, my God. <gosh. laughs> You know how many niggas I didn't just met by looking at ass? Yeah. You the 
walk by, <laughs> look at her ass, and then you look, look at the ass, you look up another nigga with her, and y'all make eye contact with her. That was some ass, wasn't it? <laughs> That's crazy, you know what I mean? But I'm saying, like. But I think, you know, so we gotta get back to the fact of what about? we have to be in order to keep a man happy. You know, so you, cause okay. you want me to be smart, so I can't be dumb. So I have to be intellectual, I have to be smart, I have to be able Depending to- Depending on the niggas. Some, you know what I mean? All street niggas ain't looking for that. No, but you gotta be smart enough to 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 move around with a street. You have to be in some capacity a smart. Okay, intelligence. Okay. Intelligence. intelligence. You have to have intelligence. Okay. Then, mm-hmm. I have to be a freak, okay? So okay. I have to keep you satisfied and big. Right. You know what I mean? So now yeah. I have to get, and yeah. then, with the world today, it ain't so no telling me what you gonna ask me to do. That's because of porn. You know? The, that's the porn, that's the easy the shit is beyond porn. Okay? Porn. porn has always been around. Porn the stuff y'all been. want now is new shit. Porn has always been around, but not porn from when you're like the fifth grade on. <laughs> I cannot imagine. Think about it. If you were in the fifth grade in like 2010, what? You're watching porn all the time. Or if you're not a nigga within 10 TV. friends of you, yeah. like, somebody, <laughs> somebody is, is watching, watching porn. porn. Yeah. So by the time you get to eighth grade, what? Instagram alone. That would have been porn. Yeah. When I was in eighth grade, to getting to watch all the just ass on Instagram, that would have been porn. For sure. In real life. Yeah. So, okay, so imagine if I don't want my man to cheat. Okay. What I have to do in the bedroom. Right. To keep him from cheating. Right. So now I, I'm already the smart lady. Right. Now I'm the freaky one. Okay. Right. Then, depending on the man too, I gotta be able to cook. So now I have to be domestic. So I have to be loving, nurturing. Okay. Then I have to support you. I have to oh, support well, hold on, you. Well, hold on. Because like you said, ain't like women just want these dusty niggas. Mm-hmm. True. Okay. Yeah. Niggas don't buy Jordans just because niggas like Michael Jordan that goddamn much. <laughs> okay. Like you know, women look at what? Women look at a watch. Mm-hmm. Look at a nigga's shoes. Look at all this other shit. Yeah. Okay. So that's one thing. That's that's where you get a lot of that vanity. Because that's an insight of what type of life I'm about to live. No, but that's a lot of the. That's where you get a lot of the vanity that you get from women. That I mean, from men. Women want to know why men have these big massive egos. It's because usually women don't come for the little dog out of the litter. True, true. The nigga that was at the end of the bitch was not having all the girlfriends. It was the nigga out there having 20 points. That's who everybody wanted. Okay? Right. Then you talk so, okay, so that, like, I'll tell you that for the intelligence. Because mm-hmm. women aren't necessarily looking for the smartest man all the time. It's usually masculinity. Whether they know it or not, true. they want a man that exudes that. True. Okay, then, like you said, I don't want these short, little bitty ass niggas. But that. That's, hold on, but that's not fucking the shit out of you. <laughs> right? Because men at least could look at a woman and say, oh, you know what? I'll, she's a little skinny for me. A man got to get literally, usually embarrassed. <laughs> okay, for well, a woman to decide, oh, you know what? I, I can't do that. Like, now I got to get out here and get it. But I'm she's saying, okay so, that's, okay, so I think maybe that's something that we're talking about is expectations. That if you love a man that's making $40,000, mm-hmm. you need to have $40,000 expectations. You cannot have fifty thousand, hundred thousand dollar expectations of the forty thousand dollar man because he got the forty thousand dollar budget. Well, make and sure that nigga only expect me to be the woman for a forty thousand dollar man. Well, what does that mean? Like you can't like yeah. So if so if you want me to take into account that you only make forty thousand dollars. What's only forty thousand dollars? Why well, is it only forty thousand dollars? See that? Okay, okay. It's forty thousand dollars. My bad. If you want, okay. See, but okay, but that comment right there, a man, like men are gonna talk about that. They're not gonna say, "Damn, I only have forty thousand dollars." Women, yes, they are. women, w- nah, you don't think men sitting at home like, "Damn, I'm making money." They're sitting at home. They're not outwardly talking about because, let you tell it, every man is balling. Okay, okay. There's no men that are really True. online. We're talking about even online. Nobody's like, "Yeah, y'all, I'm below the." <laughs> Because, like we talked about, men are supposed to be... We gotta slowly find out. Men are supposed to be providers. So now, maybe it could be based off his life circumstance, school didn't go the way he wanted it to, maybe he's Mm -hmm. still figuring out his career, because we're very much still young people. Mm -hmm. I'm not necessarily talking about 55-year-old niggas. Mm -hmm. Okay? Okay. You 55 and you make the 40, yes, you're ex... You know what I'm saying? (laughs) Like, and I feel like older women will deal with that a man making less money completely different than a younger woman does. And I think that says something that, like, we're talking about the expectations are off. Yes. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, where is the silver lining? Where is it, you know what I'm saying? Like, 
Is it like, damn, you got to understand that you got a man that you need to help build? Like, maybe you're the missing we link. Like, this building. Now I got to help you build. Then I help you build. For what? Okay. So we take all of this. No, for real. Because we take all of this time to help y'all build. We building the blocks with y'all doing all of this stuff. Then the moment you get a little bit of the foundation. Uh-huh. Nigga, he's gone. What? As soon as he's going to leave your ass for a white girl. What? Everybody had, all humans have the same emotions. Okay. They are expressed differently. Yes. Men's emotions usually come out more violent. That's why men kill. Mm -hmm. Women usually very rarely, women have to take it to like the complete edge mm -hmm. for a woman to actually kill. Mm -hmm. Even a man. A man, she could sleep next to a man that hit her every day. She is not going to kill him. True. That's he, true. You know what I'm saying? Like it, t it would take so much for Like she would have to like do something to the baby mm -hmm. for her to be like, oh, now it's too far. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So it's like all of those little things, like I talk about that bad behavior. I love him, he loves me, and I, like, people don't know, but that continues it, because now, yeah. I was watching it, we already re on all these shows, <laughs> I was watching a Mary J. Blige documentary, mm -hmm. she talks about staying in domestic violence situation, because she watched her mother do it, mm -hmm. so that was not out of the realm of her life, yeah. mm -hmm. it wasn't what she wanted, but I've seen people get beat up, I, technically, I could get beat up, yeah. and it's See, not like, normal. It's normal. It's normalized. So it's like you're talking about. It's like so much bad behavior that these conversations, hopefully, and like I said, I saw people on Twitter <laughs> being open, talking about things that I didn't even consider. <clears throat> I wasn't even recognizing that myself was bad behavior. And I'm like, damn, I, I don't want to show up in these situations as bad. Mm -hmm. Like, I truly don't. You know what I'm saying? I, I truly don't. I don't want to be ancient, nigga. I, 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 I don't. Nobody wants to be ancient, nigga. I don't. Want to be ancient, I don't. <laughs> and, the, and, and I can say a lot of the men that I am closest with mm -hmm. in life could not explain to me how to do something correct. They could just tell me what not to do, which are two totally different conversations. Really? Don't slam into the cars. <laughs> it's a lot different than how to use the brakes. <laughs> to, like, that's a totally different. You know what I'm saying? Just don't hit nobody. Okay. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And it's just like, I think that that's really what it is. So I, I want to ask this. How, how can men get better? I feel like and I, will, I will say everybody will have to get better. In order... In order because it would take women getting better at holding men accountable mm -hmm. for a man to really get better. Yeah. So it would have to be, I'm telling you, it would have to be a collective effort mm -hmm. from the community <laughs> that we're going to all get better. Yeah. Because it's, I mean, women have a, a play our role too. Yeah. So it's like, it's, it is going to take everybody like saying, okay, y'all, we're going to do better. Yeah. I think men have to like hold themselves accountable and yeah. like think about their character more. Yeah. Like, uh, like, is this the type of person that I want to be? Mm -hmm. And I think a lot of more women have to be honest with themselves and just say, you know what? This nigga's not shit, and I really want to talk to him because I want to have sex. Yeah. Usually when you're a, a woman, you don't yeah. want to have a but lot you of know, sex. You know, that's another you conversation. You find that. one man that you kind of like, and then he turns out not to be the most, the, the best partner. The best partner, you know. But... But you then you jump to another partner. <laughs> yeah, but then if you Going jump to, to another truck. partner, it's a problem. Right. So then we're no, no, no. What are you talking about? You might jump to somebody else who has a small penis. And now... Now it's like, fuck, I gotta go back. I gotta go back. Go back, go back, go back, go back. Go back. Go back. Go back.